Let's look at portfolio return. How do you calculate portfolio returns? Your portfolio return is simply the sum product of your portfolio weight, which is this column, which is this row. That's your portfolio weight, right? So, so irrespective of what happens, what you really want to make as far as this given portfolio is the portfolio weight times the actual return. So you're saying the actual return on a given day. Uh, on day one is going to be this number and this number if you trace formula and trace precedent this number is the combination of two separate vectors the first vector is portfolio weight which is 15 percent 20 percent 15 percent 15 percent 15 percent 20 percent and the portfolio return series uh, effectively what you're saying is that this number here 0.005327 is going to be the sum of this into this plus this into this plus this into this, plus this into this, plus this into this. You can, so what some product does is that it allows us to simplify this calculation. If you still want to do a simple cross check, we can do that cross check by taking the return into the weight, plus the return for the Australian dollar into the weight, plus the return of the Japanese yen into the weight, plus the return of WTI into the, the weight uh, plus the return of gold into the weight plus the return of natural gas into the weight and this combination is the same answer that we see here a simple extension cut and paste now before you cut and paste you actually have to lock in the portfolio weight rows so that when you when you when you drag and drop the formula the numbers and the results that you see here are actually accurate all right